everybody. It is Monday, March 1st, and we have over 367 plus attendees coming to our listing initiative launching today. You guys are in for a treat for the next 25 minutes or so. And uh, I'm going to let Matt and Nate take it away and then I'll tell you who I am, but I'm gonna let you find out who Matt and Nate are. And then uh, we'll talk a little bit more about this listing initiative. Matt, Nate, take it away. So a uh, quick introduction for those of you who don't know me, my name is Matt Erdman. I'm the OP of KW Greater Hartford and the OP of the Keller Williams New England region, which basically just means I get to work with two amazing teams who serve thousands of amazing, amazing agents all over New England. So very honored for that. Love being here with you guys. I am an agent at heart. I've been with KW for about 14 years, 12 years in leadership. And because I've been in leadership for 12 years, I live vicariously through all of you. Um, so I'm super excited to be here. Our goal today is to make the most important part of our business very simple, which Jen is going to show you how we're going to do that. And that's taking listings. Nate, you're up, brother. All right. So uh, everything he just said, and I am, uh, I'm Nate Dickey. I'm the OP of the Portsmouth Market Center, and I am the regional director for Keller Williams New England. So I get to do everything he just said as well. And I get to work with two great teams and we get to help you guys achieve all of your, uh, your business goals and try to help you get everything that you want out of the real estate industry. So we get to work with the leaders in your offices to help them grow and they get to help you grow. And it's very, very exciting. So thank you for having me on the call. All right. And I have to introduce you guys to Cassie. Um, Cassie's probably going to um, find me later and really not be happy about this. Yet, Cassie is really the gold to our region. And Cassie, can you just tell everybody who you are other than the Rookie of the Year? That's Go right. Award-winning prom. So thank you for that. Very kind. I did just receive the Rookie of the Year ROM Award for 2020. Very exciting. I've been with KW about six and a half years, started out uh, administratively on a team and worked my way through uh, the market center. I'm originally from Matt's Market Center down in Greater Hartford. Uh, now I get to work with this team and serve all of you at the region. Total rock star, by the way. Total, total rock star. Total rock star. We are so lucky to have her on our team. You are as well. So what is a ROM? A regional operations manager. So I just put that in the chat there. Um, so why don't we take it away, guys? I don't want to take too much time with everything. I will tell you, my name is Jen Bovey. I am the area director for the New England region. And part of my job is to come up with some trainings, have some trainers in, work with the team leaders and a whole bunch of other things along with technology. And one of the things is having events like this. This is probably the first of our kind in a long, long time, if not ever. Um, I will. I have to give props and kudos to Tiffany Hampton. I'm not sure if she's on the call right now, but Tiffany is out of the Greater Portland, Maine uh, Market Center, and she's on our team leader calls that we talk every single day. We do scripts, by the way. I don't know if any of you on this call do scripts. Team leaders do them every single day. Um, Tiffany's on those calls, and uh, she came to us with a little idea that she's bringing to her market center or brought to her market center. And if you're part of her market center, Give her some love in that chat section and tell us about her listing initiative she's already put in place for you. Well, when Tiffany told us about this idea, we said, hey, let's take this idea, merge it with what Ke Keller Williams International is doing for our leadership and bring it to our associates region wide. So just so you guys know, we have over 6,200 associates in the New England region and 434 plus of you Congratulations for being on this call because here it is, right? You guys are looking for listings. Anybody? Anyone here? I know I can't see anybody other than Matt, Nate, and Cassie. Wow. Yeah, I know in the chat section, I'm seeing a whole bunch of it. So that's why we're here. And I'll tell you a few weeks ago, probably about a month ago, we sat down with a task force to come up with this full plan that we're gonna provide for you. What this full plan is, um, and let me give credit to the task force. Tiffany, obviously Hampton is on the task force. Scott Townsend, Katie Foley, Emily Weeks, Ruth Summers, and Erica Aruda. We've been meeting weekly to make sure that the content we're going to deliver, going to deliver you today is going to be helpful for you in your business. So let's get into what that content is. Did I miss anything? All right, we're gonna get into what that content is. So Cassie, would you mind sharing the screen? Uh, 
All right, so here's what you're going to get today in the chat section a few times, and we're also going to be emailing this out. This is going to be your easy button to growing your listing pipeline. What do you get? Well, you get a full tool toolkit. Your toolkit this week is based on your database, data bank, your sphere of influence. What did Gary talk about at, at Family Reunion, guys? Do you remember? Matt and Nate? Oh my gosh, you can't put me on the spot. He talked about so many things. What well, specifically? Well, what specifically around this. Around your database is your, this, this is your control in the business. This is what protects you from everything that's coming in the business, from yes. Zillow to Redfin to all of the, the, the disruptors that are out there that are trying to take your business away from you. This is the thing that protects your business the most. Yes, and you know what I see? I love the comments because it shows me that so many of you did go to Family Reunion. He talked about having smart databases or data banks, right? So we're going to really focus on that this week for you because how many listings do you think you could possibly have in your database? Well, as we know about 6% of who's in your database, if you nurture them and you connect with them on a regular basis will become business for you. So we're going to look to attract those people. So and by the way, can I, can I jump in there real quick? Please this, do. I feel like this will be fun. Like yeah. while we're doing this, if you could do me a favor, if A, you know how many people you have in your database, do that math, 6%. If you don't, go to your phone, scroll to the bottom of your contacts. It'll tell you how many contacts you have on, in your phone. Do the math on that. 6% of the number of people you have in the database or the number of contacts you have in your phone and put it in the chat box. I'd love to see how much opportunity is sitting inside of your database. And yeah, then take it and multiply it by your average commission. Yeah, well, it's even more fun. <laughs> And you get to see the, the amount of money that's there on the table sitting in your phone. Look at that. Teresa already did that. And that's over 37,108. Look at these numbers. Wow. 132, 38, 228K. And you know, Matt, that's why we're oh, here today. Because we want to help you capitalize on that right there. On that right there. So here, here it is for you guys. Week one of your bet on KW New England. That's what... NE stands for New England, Bet on KW New England Listing Initiative Toolkit Week 1 Database. The instructions are provided for you uh, along with what we're giving to you in your toolkit. So what it includes is an email. We're going to show you that email. Don't worry. We're giving all of this to you as well. We're going to give you an email. All you have to do, guys, copy, put your phone number and your contact information in and send it to your database. Now I'm going to recommend, just like our leadership recommended at International, that you don't bulk send this. Go into your database and send them one by one because here's what it's going to do. Anybody know what, uh, Matt or Nate, why would, why would I recommend that? One by one instead of a full bulk or maybe, maybe a couple at a time, but. Well, you won't get bumped that way. Well, not only do you get bumped, you get to learn who you need to get more information from. It re-engages that you could send a note card to them. There's so many different reasons why not to just bulk send, because when you bulk send, you kind of forget about who is actually the money makers or the people that are in this database. So we're going to give you that email. We're also going to give you three, you saw my video, right? Three social media graphics. You could copy and paste these social media graphics right into your social media, whatever you use. And we're also going to give you the captions to go along with them. You don't have to think about it. You don't have to hire anybody to think about it. We're going to give it to you. So that way you could really, really, really just plug and play. So that easy button. The last one is going to be up to you guys, but we're giving you a script. The last one, Matt, would you mind? Um, I'm going to skip to the last page in the, in the toolkit. If you, if you pull up that last page yourself, you, Matt, and show them what, what do they have to do for the, for Friday's script call? Oh, for the, for the video? Yeah. Oh yeah. So it's Just super easy. What it looks like. So it's super easy. Does everybody have one of these? That, well, there's a picture of me in a racing helmet. That's my little daughter behind me, but you have one of these, not the racing helmet, but the phone, right? So don't overthink it. You pick up the phone, you hold it out and you talk to your people, right? So it's as simple as we've given you the script. Right? So it's just as simple as, hey, Nate, it's Matt Erdman with Keller Williams Realty. As your realtor, I just wanted to reach out to you and make sure you are aware of what is going on in this insane seller's market. If you were thinking at all about selling and wondering if now is the time, oh my gosh, now is the time. We have buyers for every single house. There are first-time home buyers. There are investors. There are folks downsizing. 
Our biggest challenge is we have more buyers than we have sellers right now. So if you're thinking about selling and if you're wondering if now is the time, give me a shout so I can talk to you about how you can maximize this opportunity and take advantage of incredibly low rates and incredibly low inventory. Give me a shout. How many of you awesome. could do that? We have 484 on. How many of you are okay doing that with a script provided for you? And you could send it to one person at a time or you could put it, look at all these yeses, me, me, yes. me, absolutely. I love, I love this. Love uh, all right. I'm going to be looking for these, by the way. Me too. That's why you can't, can't hide from us. Hashtag everything. Hashtag everything. K, uh, bet on KW New England. K-W-N-E. Hashtag it. That's what we're going to be looking for. Uh, the more hashtags of that, the more algorithms that we will have. I have to say Sorry, that. Sorry, what? Hello. Say that word again. No. You know what I no, just one more said. Time. Come on. We got to have fun on the call. One more I'm time. I'm going to mess it up. Algorithm. <laughs> you nailed it that time. Nice. <laughs> You guys know what I mean. Um, okay, so that video script is, is the last thing on Friday, but we're going to go through what it looks like. Oh, by the way, in here, that little blue where it says Jen Bovey presents week one, if you're not getting anything that I'm saying right now, go click on that video and I explain it yet again um, to you directly. So it's that one right there. Um, all right, let's go down a little bit, Cassie, if you don't mind. So here is that lovely email that, by the way, I saw something about personalizing. I can't really read the chat all the way, but you can absolutely add whatever you want to this email, make it personal. This, this is trying, just trying to create the easy button. And if you want a 10 plus that, please do. We encourage it. So the subject line says, only read if you don't want to sell your house. Why? Because we're looking for that hook point the hook point to have somebody say open. Now, don't forget, this is going to your sphere of influence. So people that already know, trust and love you, they will open your emails or they should anyway. If they don't, we need to call them a little bit more <laughs> during the year. All right, so here's the email. I'm not gonna read it out for you. Here's the thing. It's going to be in the toolkit that's gonna to be provided for you in this chat section. Also, it's going to be provided to you by email because you registered and it's going out to the entire region, by the way. All right, Cassie, would you mind going down a little bit further? Here is a follow-up script. And I asked Matt and Nate to step in here and do a quick little role play on this script. And, and Nate is so happy with me about this. He cannot wait uh, to role play this. this with you guys. Um, so here's the thing. We know that by sending out an email and posting stuff on social media, that might not always do it for you on, on building your pipeline. What, what's, where's the money really at? When we, what do we have to, oh, Matt did it. When we have, is the phone, this phone doesn't look like that anymore, Matt. Matt, it's 2021. What's it, what do you do now? Is this the signal now? Yeah. Can you do this? <laughs> this. <laughs> I think it's still this. Wait a minute. When you tell someone know. to roll a window down, what do you do? You don't do this, do you? Yes, you do. Do you really? But I wouldn't know what you're doing. I would, I'd be confused by that. I would do this. It's 2021, right, guys. Get with it. <laughs> All right. Anywho. Uh, um, so, so we know that it's in the calling. So it's the follow-up, follow-up, follow-up. Yes, like you said. So you're going to send that email out and then you have the entire week to pick the day or days you want to make this call on. And here's the script. Matt, Nate, you want to take it away? Ring, ring, ring. Hello? Hey, is this Nate? Yeah. Hey, what's happening, Nate? It's Matt Erdman. Yeah, hey, I'm, I'm good. I'm not a lot. What's going on with you? I haven't heard from you in a while. Just staying crazy busy. How are you and the family? Everybody's good. Everybody's Very good. Just good. got done skiing, you know, awesome. good weekend good for you, man. You are always having fun. Hey, I, I just want to reach out with all that fun you're having and see if you got that email I sent you a few days ago. Uh, yes, I did. Oh, you did. Awesome. So if you weren't already, you are fully aware of how crazy of a seller's market we're dealing with right now. It seems like everybody's selling stuff. Yeah. It seems, oh seems hot. What, what are your thoughts about the market right now? Um, well, I mean, I'd, I'd like to sell my house, maybe get something a little bit nicer, closer to the mountain, maybe, but it's, it's, you know, can I even find anything to buy? You know, what's interesting, that is probably the biggest question we get, right? Because the truth is the biggest challenge we have right now is there's more buyers than sellers, right? With that small inventory. However, there are, there are a lot of strategies that I can help you with to find that other home because the other side of that coin is because there's such low inventory, the sellers completely control the negotiation. You've got more negotiating power than you've ever had before. So there's a lot of ways that I can help you and your wife to be able to sell your home and make sure that we structure 
the contract in a way that you have the opportunity to find the next stone. So if you guys are seriously thinking about it, I'd love to chat with you. Yeah, I'd be, you know, I'd be curious to know what my place is worth. Sure, let's let's do that. Awesome. Boom. That's it. Like, no matter what he said, by the way, that is a super easy script. Super easy. If he's not, if he's not, like I didn't even ask him if he wanted to sell. I just asked him what he thought about the market, right? Which, by the way, all I said is what's on the script that this awesome team put together for you. But whatever he said, the conversation keeps going. Whether he wants to sell this house or not, then the next question, if he didn't say that, would have been, have you guys thought about taking advantage of this? Or has anyone you've known thought about taking advantage of this? So either way, it's a simple Great script. It is to continue a conversation and make sure that you are top of mind for all of your database. All right, Cassie, keep scrolling. Unless we have questions. I, I, I got to say one other thing too. Like just in case there's anybody who's all up in their head about making a phone call like that. Think get over like it. This. Number one, yes, get over it. Nate uses, he's way more direct than me. So first of all, just listen to Nate and get over it. But secondly, number one, you're not going to convince someone to sell. It either makes sense for them to sell or not. And you are their real estate advisor. Like if you had a financial advisor that managed your money in the market and, and the market was going through the roof and they didn't bother calling you to have a conversation with you about some things you could do to take advantage of that, you'd probably be pretty frustrated. And you might actually wonder how good of an advisor that person is. That's all you're doing. You're calling to make sure they're aware of what's going on and asking does now make sense for them, period. Absolutely. Love that point. Thanks, Matt. All right, let's keep going on this to get so we can get them out of here on time. So here's your Tuesday post. So easy. All you have to do is download this link or this image, post it to your social media outlets, and then copy that caption. Here it is, right? Why aren't you listing your home? And here's a couple of reasons why. With record low inventory, what is stopping you from listing your home? One, nowhere to go. Can't find another home. Conversation starter. Number two, waiting for values to go up. Conversation starter. Number three, I've already lived in my forever home or four. And then hashtag it, please, with bet on KW New England, K-W-N-E. All right. What do you think, guys? Are you liking this so far? I see a couple of I love it. Again, if you want to customize things, please do. May, put your, your Don't overthink your, it. Don't overthink it. Don't so get true. bogged down in the thinking about what I'm what am I gonna do next or I don't like that word. Get get over that. I, I love try that. This way first before you try to manipulate it. Just run with the ball. Yes. Then if you know it. if it if it doesn't work, if you just run with the ball, tell us and we'll fix it. But trust us. Just run with this. Don't overthink it. Send it out. Send it out today. Start today. Because when this is done, we'll start something else. So start, start today, this afternoon. All right, guys. So the next one we're going to keep scrolling is our Wednesday post. And anybody know what, where this post came from or this graphic came from? If you didn't answer, it's family reunion. Gary Keller gave us this market trend report. And we're just going to use that and highlight a great little, little caption. Uh, Cassie, can you just scroll up a little bit? And it goes a little something like this. And if you could relate, let us know, has, has finding a home been as hard as finding home uh, hand sanitizer during a pandemic? Inventory may be low. So what do you think that means for you as a homeowner? Remember, remember when you were buying two ounce hand sanitizers for a premium, question mark, hashtag bet on KWNE, right? Just a fun little caption post for, to relate people back to where we just have been and about the local market. Use it guys. All right, next one really quickly. Well, yeah, I got a good question in the chat from somebody. Should they be posting this on their personal page or their business Facebook page? So what, I, what I've heard is you post it on your business and then push it to your personal. If you have a business, put it on your business, push it or uh, share, it. Share, share it to your personal. All right, here's another one. Here's a fun one for them. Uh, what about their dream home? Your dream home await <laughs> caption. In the current market, homes are selling for well over list price. If you were to cash in on your current property, which one of these will be your next dream home? Here's the thing, guys. It's just a conversation starter. See how many comments you get just on this. It's the hook point, and it's how you're going to, going to be able to then go into Messenger for everybody who commented on your post and say, hey, I saw that you or you commented on my post. Would love to have you love to have a business conversation about the market with you. In the door. 
having conversations with everybody in your Facebook. And then the last one we already went over, which is that Friday call, is that Friday video script. You literally get your phone out, hit record, upload it to Facebook. If you're not sure how to upload your videos, I'm gonna put my email in the chat right now. Just email me. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping, you know, 2021, we know how to do that. Yet if you have a challenge with not knowing how to upload your videos, let me know and I'm happy to walk you through how to post your video to social media just to make sure that that, that does get done. All right, guys, before I tell them about the contest, what are, you, what are your words on what we're going through so far? Matt, Nate, I anything? Think I, I, and this, this, this is a, this is gratitude for the team who helped put this together. I think it's amazing. So, and I didn't do it, so I can say that I'm not talking about what I did. I'm talking about what the team did. It's an easy button. And I saw that a couple of times in the chat box. The idea is it's an easy button. We're trying to make it as simple as we possibly can for you to engage with the market, with your database to get the most important asset in our business right now, other than our actual clients, which is listings. I think it's, it's too easy not to do, and I'm, I'm excited for it. So good luck. All right, thanks guys. And to close us up, I'm gonna tell you about how we're gamifying this whole thing. Not only are we making it easy for you and fun, hopefully, we're gonna be giving away some money. The region approved to give away some money during a contest of giving you content. So you ready for this? Here's how it works. And all the information will be provided to you in the emails. Cassie, make sure that all of the details are provided to you multiple different ways. This is also being recorded and we will be posting the recording of this if you missed any part of it. So the contest part, every Monday at two o'clock from two to 2.30, you have to come on live with us to get the next week's toolkit, the most important piece. And when we do the drawings, you guys see that gold uh, cage behind me? We're going to be drawing a name of a winner each week. How do you become a, how do you become a contestant in our little drawing? Well, you get a listing. Each week, if you get a listing, your name goes into that cage, right? Or, or number or however we're going to do it. And we're going to pull a person live every week. Now I'll tell you, it'll be at the end of the call because we want to make sure you're there for the whole call. Just a spoiler alert. And in order for you to win, you have to be here live. What, did, what was that, guys? Have to be here live. Don't be that person whose name gets called and is not on the call. Have okay. to be here live. Thank you, Matt. I, I'm glad you heard me. You have to be here live to win. And then we also will do a validation to make sure that listing has been entered either into MLS in win more, or if it's not MLS, we just have to confirm that before we send out. And how much, how much are we giving away each week? How much are we giving away each week? I don't really Five, I remember. You, 500. I almost did that with cool fans. And I was like, wait, that could mean something else. $500. $500. $500. Wait, but wait, there's more. <laughs> there's but more. wait, we've got knives for you. We don't have that, no, but there no is more. Knives, but more money, more we've money. Got more money. So what do we have at the end of our six week initiative? We're pulling a grand prize winner. So everybody that got a listing goes back into the cage and we're pulling a $2,000 winner. Can any, can anybody use an extra, I don't know, $5,000? Just, just for doing what you're supposed to do every day? And what? us giving you the content? <laughs> wow. And obviously the real value is the relationships you generate with your clients and the commissions that roll in, but this sure as hell doesn't hurt. It makes it fun. Yes. All right. We're going to close up here, but we'd love to see if you guys have any questions or maybe so what, do, what kind of energy do you guys have behind us? Are you excited for it? Um, and please, I'm going to put my email in again. If you have any suggestions, thoughts, or ideas for the initiative, email me. We're happy to look and review at everything to help you guys. Hey, Matt, Nate, anything else before we wrap it up? No, I'm just excited, excited to see what you guys do. No, sorry, go ahead, Nate. No, I just said I'm excited to see what they do. I want to see uh, lots of new listings come in. Let's dominate the market. Yeah, we want to see what year. happens in New England. I mean, come on. What happens when we all get more listings? We get more listings, we get, get more, more buyers, we share. get more market share, we get all that stuff. So listings, we get our, solve it all. We get our life by design, we get our legacy, we get all of that. But not only that, your buyers are going to be so happy at you, right? With you, at you, with you. They'll at be you. happy with you. Or at you. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> I'm happy at you right now, Jen. If you're a buyer's agent on this and you're saying this isn't for me, it is. Because if you get a listing, your buyer is going to be very happy with you that you have inventory for them. So guys, this initiative is for any agent of any production anywhere. So guess what? There are going to be people that are going to be using what we're doing. And that's okay. We want people to get more listings, but we want to give you a chance to do it first and to win at it. So I hope you have a great week. I'm looking forward to week two to get some results. Cassie is also going to be sending out a form that you fill out each week with your listing. So when you get a listing, you fill out this form with the listings you have, your name goes into our barrel. All right, guys, I think I'm out. I think I'm, I'm out. That was a lot, Jen, you did great. <laughs> I, I only have one last thing to say. Education without action is entertainment. And while we hope you enjoy your 30 minutes with us, we are not entertainers. So it's go true. out there and take action. Very true. Yes, please go. That's, That's it. it, guys. All right, we're out. Literally, we're done. Bye, guys. Have a good week.